Hi folks, welcome to the channel. So before I say anything, I think I have to make an apology. I was coming down in the lift there and they're stainless steel doors, they're brushed stainless steel, it's not like a mirror or anything, but they look green. And Don Don, <laughs> my lime green, very bright t-shirt, so I have to apologize for my lime green t-shirt. <laughs> So today we're going to go to a couple of places that are supposed to be absolutely wonderful, amazing. Now, they're a good distance away, hour and a half, maybe two hours, which is about the furthest I've driven for a video. Well, apart from driving around Europe, that is. <laughs> so I'm really looking forward to seeing these, weather permitting. It's re reasonably nice now, but the weather forecast says there's a good chance of rain, and where I'm going, I don't think rain will help but we will see. First place, it's a mountaintop village, a really, really old Spanish mountaintop village, and it's surrounded by epic, unbelievable looking mountain ranges. And the second place, well, it's a surprise, and I've been busting to go to it for a, for a while. So buckle up and I hope you enjoy. So, a bit of a drive, probably keep quiet the rest of the way. So, I'll see you at our first stop. 12 seconds later. You may notice that I wasn't going to talk anymore. So I don't know if, you can see, if it can be seen in camera, but there's several wee cuts right across my face. Um, <laughs> uh, I did something stupid yesterday. It was a cold day, and I decided I was just going to sit in, a few wee jobs to do, and one of them was, recalibrating my drone and putting new propellers on it because it was drifting and to cut a long story short did all the work that needed to be done went out on my balcony put it up in front of me and it did, didn't seem to be drifting I was only looked at it for a second but then I'm looking down at the controller again and when I looked up it had drifted and it was just about to hit my air conditioning unit and whenever the blades hit it goes crazy so my automatic reaction was to put my hand, I cut my hand as well, was to put my hand up and it hit my hand and it was like a vacuum, it just vacuumed right across my face. I uh, could have went in any direction but my face got it. So you know whenever you were young and your mum would say to you, be careful of that, that'll take your eye out. She's right. My age, I'm still doing things that'll take my eye out. <laughs> oh I don't know. Right, so I'm not going to do much talking, I have a good drive ahead of me, I'm going to turn off the camera and talk to you again when we get to the first location. So, onward and upward. More moments later. Trying out a few experiments today. Okay, <laughs> okay, still talking. Sorry, I can't help myself. Just can't help myself. We things just keep coming into my head. I mounted my GoPro that I'm using now differently on my dashboard. And it's in a brilliant spot. But it's done with blue tack and it's sliding gradually. Anyone any idea how to make blue tack solid? <laughs> um, also, I've changed some settings in my camera, so this could all be a disaster, or it could all be far better quality. We'll see. These are more salt lakes to the south of Guadamar this time, but massive area. This road snakes right through it. Apparently there's flamingos out there, or flamingos. The birds, the pink birds. Maybe I'll find them someday. It's getting duller and duller. Benidorm, never been. One of the only big resorts I haven't been in. Not the sort of place I fancy nowadays, but maybe during the good weather I'll go and have a visit. Drizzle, for flip's sake. Rain. It's just gradually getting heavier. So much for the epic mountains, can't bloody see them. For flip's sake, I'm almost here and it's still raining. Now it's a very, very old town. Bit dull actually. Of course it is dull today. Nice 
situation there that happens. Just the right. This is the Barne of Pull Up, which is just a <coughs> what looks like a beautiful Spanish town. I need the rain to stop. I'm not gonna go for a walk in the rain. I brought a jumper, but I'm not gonna go for a walk in the rain. Let's see. Eventually. Right, so it's still raining, but there's been a lull in the rain. And I thought, the hell with it. While I was sitting there for about 15 minutes waiting. And it just reminded me, one of the very first videos I ever made at the Giants Causeway. It was sleet and wind and snow. And one of my favorite videos ever it ended up. Ashback. Flashback. So I thought I would just go for it. Well, this is lovely. This is beautiful. Well, we want to see what places are like without tourists. It's a perfect day. The Castillo de Pulop, been here since the 12th century, where it was built to guard, protect the town from threats. As many of these hilltop towns are, they're built up high in case of attack. Don't think that would count too much anymore. As ever, I love these sort of places. My brain goes to what was this like? seven or eight hundred years ago the people would have been so different my intention was to walk around the town i don't really see the point but isn't this fantastic i was going to put the drone up but it doesn't like the rain And these are all burial crypts in the grounds. So I don't know who the who's buried there. And they all seem to be empty. Where have all the bodies gone? So, quick look around. Time to move on. Hopefully it's not raining by the time we get to the next place, which isn't too far from here. Thank you. The rain seems determined to stay on. I'm nearly at the second place. Go away, rain! Sun, come out! I wasn't expecting this. This area is absolutely stunning. I wish, <laughs> I wish you could see it. Oh, my drone wanted to go up so much today. Clouds and rain didn't play along with me. Right, just had a great idea. I know how to pass the time, a bit of time, hopefully the rain will go off while I'm passing the time. Ta -da! Sorry, I just couldn't resist. One hour later. Right, 
So that plan worked, well it almost worked. It's practically stopped raining. Had to go a good drive to get from the food. But I'm feeling full. I'm only assuming this is the way to go. There's a lot of water coming down this road. How beautiful would this be in good weather? Entrance. Don't know if this is a free or pay in place. It says it closes in 45 minutes. A few moments later. <coughs> you frightened the crap out of me. My god, there's a fence there. Of course, if there was no fence there, that dog would have eaten too many people, but now he'd be gone. <laughs> Bamboo. There's a type, a bit of useless information, there's a type of bamboo that grows in Thailand and it's the fastest growing plant in the world. It grows at 90 centimetres a day and it grows until it falls over and grows again. There you go, be tidbit. Oh this is wonderful, I love places like this. Just rip turned out you do pay in. How much? Four. Thank you. Yes. Can I take yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Thank you. You see that's a good thing. Because look at all the beautiful stuff I've seen before Peter. Oh my. I am here to dress. Fantastic. And would you believe you're allowed to swim? It's too cold. Oh, I would just love to go in there. I'll be back here in a warm day. Absolutely wonderful. You know, I've been walking now for about 20 minutes. I forgot it started to rain as soon as I started to walk up the path and forgot about it. Completely forgot about it. Makes no difference. The main thing is it isn't cold. Um, yeah, rain makes no difference. This is fantastic and I am glad I'm here on my own. A little bit of nice atmosphere for people here. But wonderful find. I just met a really nice Dutch fella and we stood there talking for 10 minutes. He's been right up to the very end of it so I know what to expect. But I would love the video of me talking to him, you know. But I'm not that adventurous yet. yet. I'm worried about embarrassing people. Ah well. No doubt I'll get there. I think I got a wee clip of the woman at the pay counter. From this point on, if you're a bit unsteady in your feet, it's a bad idea to come up here. So I'm going to have wet feet the rest of the day. Four o'clock, be all right. It's a bit, maybe I'm a bit too unsteady in the face. Oh, we'll, we'll carry on.
I don't come into the wall. So the thing is, if you don't go exploring, you don't find. I used to be one of those people until fairly recently. Went to holiday resorts and spent all my time in them. And since I've started my journey, 2021, and really mainly for the purpose of these videos, I started to explore. And now I know what I missed out on in my life. Fantastic. Don't just sit in your hotel resort, hire a car, hire a scooter, take a bus trip and go explore. Marvellous. <laughs> just as I was leaving, there was a man and woman coming in and the man was talking to the guy I'd been talking to earlier on and the woman was standing in her own so I smiled at her and just smiled back and I looked up at the waterfalls and said beautiful and she said oh thank you <laughs> yeah probably made her day but it wasn't intentional so there you go I hope you enjoyed, enjoyed that wee day trip sort of feel like I should say sorry about the weather but I've had a good day anyway I'm gonna leave this one off there Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, subscribe, give it the big button, give it a push. Really helps the channel, I can't tell you how much. Love your comments, thumbs up. But until next time, bye for now.